Nalamaya means our place in Noongar language. Um, Nala means our, and Maya, which was once um, the um, ampi, the structure of a home in the bush, was called Maya Maya. Um, so, yeah, Nala Maya is our place, our home. The Nala Maya story comes from a gap that I realised and seen in the community that none of our boys and girls were getting, uh, after release from prison, the reintegration process. They weren't um, uh, get trained, getting no sort of training or any life skills um, to bring, people, bring them together. Um, it's because of my lived experience and that, I think, and a part of the um, justice system myself, that I had that um, understanding and communication with the community anyways, and from all the fellows that I'd done time with in the past as well. Yeah, well, the government wasn't, um, the rehabilitation process in the prison system was um, none, null and void, nothing. Um, when you talk about real life opportunities and creating those opportunities and up, having the skills to go out in the community and uh, get jobs and that, um, none of that was trained in the, uh, none of that sort of training was ever delivered in the prisons and for my Noongar people and that's where I see that gap, our people were just getting, coming out of the prison, just given parole. We have a good relationship with the prisons um, to, to a degree because um, my, my, my other act is political, uh, I'm a political with the activism and that that I do and you know um, they see that as a little bit of a barrier in the prisons because I'm also the death in custody chairperson in West Australia and so they get a bit weary of that and um, stuff like that but the prisons have been pretty good but not, not, not how they should be. Uh, my name's Corey Penny and um, I'm working down on the uh, TBM with Cellini and Pedgrove as a rect operator and uh, yeah I got the job through Merv, Nalamaya. Um, yeah straight from jail, straight to the course, done an eight week program with Merv and uh, yeah he got me a job down in uh, uh, Wills at Forest Field and now we're mining through the airport. Yeah. Yeah, so I, I work a robotic arm with a remote and it builds the inside tunnel. So every time the TBM moves forward off the cylinders, the TBM stops and then I build the inside walls, the segments inside of the tunnel and then TBM pushes off again. I build the inside of the tunnel, TBM, TBM pushes off again. Yeah. So I sort of body arm with a, a remote that's cordless. I couldn't get a job before if it wasn't for Nalamaya. Um, applied everywhere, done so much, but still nothing because of my criminal record and since previous charges inside jail. And um, yeah, Nalamaya was that, that little gap I needed just to get that job. Yeah. We, we offer the, um, um, a huge part of what we do is mentoring, the mentoring and that support and that social, psychosocial support. Um, not nine to five, uh, you know, just beyond. Um, and also helping um, help, help, helping get the boys and girls to understand that they are worthy and they are able to do whatever they want to do. And, you know, it's giving them, giving them that um, little bit of hope. And, and when I say um, about the psychosocial stuff, you also got to uh, work with families, though, the, the family environment as well. And, you know, on, Lots of different issues, legal issues, um, housing issues and stuff around, you know, the dynamics of the home and the structures that each of these boys and girls come from that come out of the prison system. You can't just work with the, them alone. You also got to work with the dynamics of their families. I didn't finish school. Um, suspended, expelled. I had a rough, pretty much childhood. Um, in and out of the court system, jail, um, till couple of years ago, then done a stint in jail for a big charge, got out and yeah, um, yeah, I've had a rough childhood, teenage, and then I've just clicked, tried to get jobs, which other departments couldn't help me um, fill that gap in, but no, none of my own, yeah, they filled that gap in pretty well. And from there, straight to a good job, paying a good salary.
It was my goal to get up and out there and it finally happened so yeah I'm happy about that. Got that goal ticked off. I got myself into uh, working with Blink Force. Um, it's been good so far. It's been probably my sixth um, stint of working up and out of Perth. It's fun, something new. TA work, training assistant, helping like all the qualified like fitters, boilermakers, um, etc., and all that. Um, and yeah, like get a like hold of like heavy equipment and all that. It's fun but it's good. Get to go on like all the EWPs, all the machines and all that. It's all fun. Another my them guys help they get they help me out um, to do my four week course to get all my tickets and that helped me like they helped me push to get up on the mines. So I was quite happy to get like involved with these fellas. Um, yeah, because I knew I was going to get something out of it, get a job, um, get my life on, on a roll, get the ball spinning and all that. Coming through this program and being with Nalamaya has, has given me the tools and the capabilities of um, controlling the outcomes in which, you know, it has, has, has been in the past where I've, I've, I've not turned up for work I've um, had, that, had those struggles sort of thing, so I work with a worldwide renowned company. Um, they're, they're originally based in Italy. Uh, they're over here for a project in WA, um, the Forestfield Airport Link project. Um, so we've tunnelled from Forestfield to the international airport. I've been promoted to uh, safety rep for both tunnels. But yeah, also I have to go back down into the tunnel and do the work as a, as a worker, as a tunnel worker, which is pretty full on. You work 12 hour days. Um, I'm on a roster of 7374, so I'm on my four days off as we speak right now. Then I go on to night shift on Monday night. Yeah, these, these um, programs and these whatever help and courses, or even just getting your foot through the door at Nullamaya and um, having a yarn with Merv is just, you wouldn't realise it, but it's, it's it's really, it's, it's really a good thing to do because it not only helps you get to where you want to be within like gaining full-time employment, it just gets you a bit more like um, a bit more structure in your life. Um, Merv's, Merv's one of them blokes, he can understand where you're coming from as soon as you walk through the door. He knows, he knows by a look on your face like where, you've, where, where you're going, where you've been. Um, having a yarn with him is just like having a yarn to an older older brother, an uncle, like even a father figure, role model. Um, he's been there, done that sort of thing, you know? Like, whatever struggles you may be going through, he's, he's already been there, done that. So he can understand wherever, wherever you're going in life. For three and a half years, um, we were unfunded, community driven, and, you know, sometimes we got our power turned off our um, internet and, or phone or something. And, you know, we just battled for three and a half years um, to get it to where we, are uh, now where we're actually um, federally funded at the moment and you know um, it took a long time to get to that process and you know a lot of um, a lot of um, barriers that we had to over overcome. Um, well, set setting up here was well I actually um, rented the the, um, the building not knowing exactly what I was going to do in it uh, in the beginning and that's when I, um, I knew I had to do something for my people, but I didn't know exactly what it was. Then um, employment came to my mind, and which, which, which was a huge gap. Even coming in here doing the courses and gaining full-time employment, employment isn't the actual, isn't just a major um, change in your life. You, you can change to be a better person. Like that's, that's the way I think of it. Merv's made me a better person by coming through these doors at none of my. Just don't give up, just keep on pushing till you get that job. That's what Merv's told me. He said, just keep on trying, 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 and you'll get it. I get all of my success from our people succeeding, and that's what makes me feel good.